going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. And today you join me with man like Tom. Going, mate, okay, okay, bro. Good. All good, mate. All good, you? Yeah, good, good, good. So, single turbo M3. That's the one. F80 M3. F80 M3. Only one in the UK, as far as I'm aware. So, so this. First things first, Tom Wrigley, who are you? Where are you located, mate? So this is us, Tom Wrigley Performance. We're based in Oswald Street, Shropshire. Yeah. Um, sort of Midlands area. So specialising in M cars, B58, S55. Customer car, that's the thing. Customer car, just being completed. Uh, running our full single turbo kit, which we developed with Walton Motorsport. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, really serious bit of kit. Just Absolutely a, stunning, man. Yeah. Black so on black. Signature wheels, obviously, we're the main guys in the UK for those. Mm -hmm. It's got my own AP brake kit on there as well, the Pro 5000s. Right. Uh, Olin suspension, it's got the top mounts. Oh, wow. Single turbo kit, port meth injection. The software's all been done by Mike Ball at More BHP, uh, mapped via MHD. Yeah. It's got three switchable maps, so you've got just a pump fuel one, a pump plus meth, and then a kind of 109 plus meth kill map, we call it, right. um, which really kind of opens up this turbo, um, just shy of 800 horsepower. For people into their draggies, it's 100 to 200 in 4.5, so, but this is a full weight car as well, you've got to remember, you know, yeah. this is um, got all the interior inside, it's a road car, it's not a stripped Crazy. out, gutted, one-off kind of it's car. It's still a 4.5. Exactly, yeah, with a full interior, you know, and that's how all these cars are, you know, we've got lots of different cars about the place, and as yeah, you can yeah. see, Loads, yeah. um, this is another single turbo one we did here. Mm. So that's all built here. That's a nice bit of kit. Um, but is yeah. this a stock engine? Uh, it's a stock engine, stock, stock engine. clutches, stock gearbox. The, the customer's probably going to look at doing pistons and rods in it um, just so you can maximise the turbo. Yeah. As, as with all these things, the turbo is capable of a lot more power, but we, we're always up against the stock engine limits. Um, what is the turbo? Is it one of your turbos? <clears throat> so it's a Garrett turbo, mm -hmm. G35 1050. But the manifold and downpipe and all this has all been developed with with the Bolton Motorsport, so we've done it together. Was, uh, insane, yeah, no, it's good, it's good stuff. So proper intake, it's a large intake pipe. Um, so it's three and a half inch all the way to the, from the turbo in. Mm -hmm. It's a very tight squeeze. One meth port here, and then we've got a meth port rail there as well. So uh, is it uh, running meth full time? Yeah, it, like, it yeah. does have a map one, which is just non meth. But yeah. once you've had a taste of the meth pump plus meth, like you're never yeah. really going to use. I'll be honest, you're never going to use that map. We've got a motive controller for the boost, so that plugs into the car's ECU, so that it's fully ECU controlled. A lot smoother, a lot safer. Now Mike, uh, who maps it for me, Mike Ball, he can uh, kind of select boost for an RPM, for a certain gear load, everything. He can change the boost totally dependently. The problem right. before was it was just a fixed boost controller, so it, it target 30 PSI and it'd just be 30 PSI all the time, oh, which yeah. was no good. You know, first, second gear, the stock clutches wouldn't take it. So now we're tapering it up. And whilst when we're in third and fourth gear, we can taper the boost, you can play with it and get the torque exactly how we want. So it's safer for the stock engine, mm -hmm. but it's still, um, it's still powerful and still doing the numbers. Seven speed dual clutch transmission. Yeah, that's uh, all standard. Stock clutches. Stock clutches. Yeah. Mike's done some really trick software again. He's got some brilliant gearbox software. Mm -hmm. um, it can hold massive torque on the stock clutches. Walton have done a fantastic job. It's all tubular, um, perfectly equal length and everything. So that's what makes a difference. So you get a good spool up, but then you're away from the traditional cast manifolds, which retain a lot of heat and you know a lot of back pressure on the engine. So Sound you can really good push. as well. Yeah, amazing. Well, we'll start yeah. up in a minute, yeah, and yeah, it's it's proper. You jump back to him. Yeah, okay, let's we'll go. Let's we'll give it a couple of revs if you want. Yeah, yeah, go on, then, yeah. Guys, quick reminder, tonight, 10.30, I'm going to be revealing the winner of the BMW M3 and the Ducati. Absolute last chance to get yourself a ticket. Around 10 quid, one of you guys watching right now most likely will be the winner. Trust me, it's very, very real. We've had around 20, maybe 30 winners so far. Even if you've not bought a ticket, head over to the Facebook and see what it's all about. It's super transparent, very, very real. And as I say, you've still got a couple of minutes left to get yourself a ticket. So yeah, fingers crossed and good luck to everyone who's purchased tickets. Mate, this car feels very rigid, doesn't it? Yeah, so it's Olin's, mate. Bro, it's like we're not even in an M3 right now, man. Jesus, that sounds sick. Yeah, oh, it's, it's unbelievable, man. Know, man. There's not much lag either. That's what's really, really surprised even me with them. Bro, the Olins are making this feel mad. Yeah, they're, they're, they're the only suspension for the road you want to fit. They're just awesome. Have a listen. Jesus. <laughs> Tom, what's the diff? Stock? Stock diff, yeah. Stock yeah. diff? Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's 
Doc Ellis Because the other one had the Drexler in it, didn't yeah. it? So it's, it's, one. Yeah. Yeah, the stock diff's... Um, it's a good diff, it just wears out, that's the problem. So we're just in pump fuel plus meth, which is kind of go-to map, really. Uh, and when, when does um, turbo kick in, roughly? 4K? No, Hello? before, mate. I'd say about Four, three yeah? and a half, yeah. I mean, okay. it's, it's, it's really responsive. This is a bit quieter, isn't it? This yeah. Moment? It's a bit quieter, isn't it? That's it cool. Top, like just to be uh, different just or? character yeah I mean a, a lot of reasons one I think it's safer for the stock engine okay two the character I mean we've, it gives you a vibe of an old school Jap car but we're still in an M3 you know yeah. we've got a nice interior we've got a dual clutch transmission nice stereo we're not too noisy end of the day you can close the valves and the exhaust and we can go and have some fun down you know mm -hmm. down the road or we can take your family away in it it's, it's kind of all in one yeah and third of all, the noise and you know, like I say, it's just it's an animal. Yeah. Have a listen to that, that noise. It's Jesus, you don't get that from an M3. Man. No, not normal. What the hell? I would have always said the B58 was the best sounding, but yeah. a single turbo S55. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jeez. Turbo manual, Tom. Would oh, no, that? mate, I'd love to do that. Really. You know what I'm feeling? I think I'm getting a lot of feedback. I can feel what's going on from the passenger. With a car like this, you need to be connected, though. But when he's turning, I can feel the fucking wheels on the floor. Like, you don't really get much feedback with the, uh, with the M3. They're good handling cars, but... Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's mental, isn't it? Not to 60 real quick. So, so the 4.4 map pushing things, right? Very, very hard. Yeah. You know, you're pushing the stock engine. I mean, you're doubling the stock horsepower, stock torque. So, I mean, you know, there's, there's yeah, it, it's used at your own discretion, really. I mean, any kind of tune, as you know, but there's always a risk. You just try and choose the best people and the best parts to, to limit that risk as best you can. But um, using that, Map three for a prolonged period of time. Like I wouldn't recommend it for top speed runs, you know that kind of thing. Short sure, hundred to two hundred, it's not as bad for it, but you know it's pushing things. You know, end of the day, like I said, you're using a stock engine and you're competing, as we just said before, with 720s's. That kind of competition, you know. So just listen to it there. <laughs> it sounds better. Even just you know 50% throttle, just different. And then you know on the downshifts. That is sick. Jesus. Extremely fast car. It's man. just it, like everything gets sped up, isn't it? I mean, <laughs> it's, it's, it's like when it comes on boost, it's like fast forward. <laughs> yeah. Bang. I know it's quite stiff, yeah. this ride, but it's so. I feel like planted. Yeah. Tom, man, let's end it there, mate. Thanks for the little yeah, no. spin around the block, buddy. Always good to see you, mate, as always. And um, yeah, nice one, mate. Looking forward to quick, quick reminder where people can find you. Yeah, well, so we're Tom Ready Performance. Uh, we're Oz Street, <coughs> so the Midlands, Shropshire area. Um, BMW specialist. Um, yeah, do everything from, from servicing all the way to 1,000 brake horsepower builds. So anything you need, get in touch. We can do it all. There we are, back at the track now. And back to you, mate. There we go. This is a brand new build that we've just put up now, so it's going to have a four-wheel drive down and everything. That's all going in any week now, so yeah, we've got a nice facility. Slow me down like speed, homie. 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 Keep up when I speed up. See your future, that's my past. Yeah. See the smoke when I drive past. Yeah. Fast lane, living life fast. See your girl, she's in my car. Mm. Oh well, 
that's your girl in my hotel that's five stars. Yeah. Make the roof yeah. disappear.